Mukchan really went from leave me alone, mind your own business, you can't protect me, I don't need no man to oh my gosh, she don't pick you up soon. Now, it makes sense, right? If you think about the fact that her heart was locked away. So in that sense, now that her heart is unlocked, it's more expressive. It makes sense, does it? I don't know. I thought the funniest shit, though, was when Elliot got off the wheelchair. You know, when people get off the wheelchair like that, some shit is about to go down. Have you ever seen those clips on YouTube where, like, um, it's almost like fake scripted church scenes where, like, a person will be on, like, a wheelchair and a pastor will be like, I, I don't know, command you, stand! And the guy will fucking be like, oh my god, I used to be paralyzed but i'm standing now it kind of reminded me of that what are we doing this episode i think it's a date with Mukuchan. and then kudumi arcs in let's begin today's reaction yo where's shiro's arm placement there look at muku's ears man like what, look at that what, what is that you can see the space in it maybe there are portals maybe you can go into her ears man but that's not her ear it's her like hair band thing it makes her look like she has cat ears she's not though what are those ribbons bro what what are those ribbons that have space in them uh, I don't know. What are we gonna do? Do we have anything in common? Okay. I mean, Toka is easy because all we do is just eat food with her and it's nice and simple, but... Huh? Haircut? No. No one will cut Muku's hair. Wonder why. Her hair is super long, I just realized. I can't remember why. It probably has to do with her flashback. Maybe her sister back in her old family liked her hair. Now she wants to keep it like this forever. Yeah, we need some backup. Come on. Uh, half she's a tie it up. Half, I don't see option three though. Option three is probably degenerate. Wedding dress. Oh. Option three is kind of nuzzling it. Let's go with that one actually. Kyohei? Of course. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Maria also agrees. No, option three. You want to hold her hair for her. Ma'am, it's an honor. Are the other spirits going to be here? Ah, all the Siskon moments are coming in clutch. The captain. Sister. You remember your sister, right? How much of her memories does she remember? Because she says she can't remember why about her hair. I mean, holy shit. Can we get a bigger size, please? Kotori didn't like that. Kotori didn't like that at all, huh? Reproduce it? What do you, what do you mean? Huh? Spirit power can just change outfits like that. Sure, why not? <laughs> I don't know. For the fan service, of course. Her hair is so long, man. She could fucking beat someone up with that. She could probably strangle someone with that. And you guys have said there's a lot of uh, Chinese references to her outfit and her design, right? Uh, don't say it. Uh, it's, it's... Well, do we? Uh, like, let's get serious. But like, what does the love mean here? Or is this, are you doing this because that's your job? It's like... Uh, she's probably at a certain level. She does love her. She wants to. He wants to protect her and everything. But like, oh, we can't do that. We can't do that though, because this is a harm show. Uh oh. Yeah, we, we're basically trying to save all the spirits. Therefore, we need to kiss every one of them. But uh, Muku might not be into that. Is she gonna be okay? Muku, everyone is getting along. You can join the. You can join them. They're good friends. Maybe. What are you going to do? I'm kind of worried now. What are you going to do? I don't think she's given up on, you know, keeping Shiro for herself. Maybe she'll, like, lock away all the other spirits' hearts. So only Muku and, like, Shiro can be together. I don't I don't have a good feeling. Oh, Kotori. Different hair. I mean, never see her with the hair down like this. No ribbons, huh? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. She locked away their memories? Like, how did she... Uh, okay, well, bye! Alright, make your own fucking breakfast then. Good luck with that. Damn. Muku really just made everyone forget. Gross. Gross. Not anymore. I'm not hitting on you. 
Gross. Clearly, Muku did this. But how? She can lock everyone's memories away. I don't know if she knows who you are. Nah, she doesn't know who you are, right? Even Origami! Origami of all people saying that kind of hurts, man. Origami of all people to say that, Jesus. You know, I bet who would still know? I bet Kurumi would know. Kurumi, where are you at? You think even like Elliot wouldn't know at this moment? How did you get the number? Ah! Blocked. Oh no, even the lollies are gonna say, Who are you, mister? It's so nice that Yoshino has another lolly friend to hang out with, though. Oh no, police! Police! <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. This is a bad look. <laughs> oh no! Don't talk to strangers, little girls. You're gonna make her cry! I bet Kurumi now. Kurumi, where are you at? Show up, Kurumi. Come on, Kurumi, come on. Oh, he can still use their power so good. Yeah, he should be able to just unlock their memories or something. I don't really know how this all works, but on a conceptual level, right? Everything is done that way. Oh? I will lock your key so your key doesn't work anymore. Muku, why are you doing this? You know that we have to have a harm, right? This is our job. Yeah. Look how happy she is. Now you don't need to worry about me. Now we can be all alone forever and ever and ever and ever. <laughs> Muku! Bad girl! No! We can't be doing that! Not right now. No. That, that looks kind of dangerous. But no, not right now, Muku. Bad Muku. Yeah, he happened to know everyone else too. Maybe... Shido... They'll all start to remember Shido together slowly, even without having to unlock them because their feeling for Shido is so strong. Uh-oh. Darling, darling. You created it yourself! Blame yourself! Origami, you can't remember of all people? Maybe the memories are coming back first to her. Because, like, Origami is one of the most dedicated loyalists to Shido, right? Mm? She got it. Moigami is back! That's not Origami! Why did Moigami... Can you always just do this? What do you mean? Moigami remembers because Muku probably didn't... I don't know. Because Moigami wasn't always present, Muku probably couldn't lock her away. They don't even know Mukuro, huh? You know, the stalker that was trying to make you breakfast today. <laughs> Moigami sounds like a, a cultist right now. Oh, yes, our lord and savior, Itsukashido saved us, remember, guys? Everyone's memory is slowly coming back. Invert. Invert right now. Invert. Do it. Her eyes are a bit different. She did an invert there for a second. Where was that? Toka's eyes are totally different. Not right now, Muku. No. Bad Muku. No, Muku. Stop talking in third person, you cute motherfucker. Yeah, you're so cute. I know you're so cute. God damn it, I can't stay angry at you. Hmm. They're connected somehow, because Shido can remember her dreams. Her past. How are they connected like that? I don't think Shido can do that with any other spirits. Origami! Could you argue that maybe Origami is the best girl because she's the only one that was able to break out and remember who Shido was? It's not technically fair because this isn't Origami, you know, this is Moigami, and because of that, you know, Muku wasn't able to lock her memories away, but still. Yeah, and I expect Kurumi to still know Shido at this point, maybe? Origami, I'm telling you, top tier girl. I can't believe. Like, I hated her in season one. She dead ass might be one of my favorite girls right now. Uh -oh. Don't let her do it. Metatron! <laughs> Fuck it! Inverted spirit! I don't even know what that's called for Origami. D-E-M? Uh, A-S-T. Tenka! Tenka! Tenka outfit! No, not Toko anymore! Her outfit's different! Yo! I can't believe she fucking inverted that casually! Nahema! <laughs> Is she trying to help or what?! Ah, and then redirect it, right? 
Dude, we haven't seen Tenka since like end of season two. Toka's memories are, but this is different. Origami, Moigami, Toka, Tenka, you know, all these inverted forms are different entities, therefore they were not able to be locked away. No! Oh, don't, don't make her cry! <laughs> no, not Toka. They haven't officially named her in this show, right? Yeah, they haven't said Tenka. You guys have been just spamming Tenka, so I know, but... Hmm... Moigami! With the fucking talk no jutsu actually convinced her! Yeah, what is your goal? What are you doing here? Yeah, what, what are you trying to do again? Until I purge the shame caused by this man. Purge the shame? It sounds like she's not able to realize her love for you though. Oh. Oh yeah, that happened. That definitely happened. True! Wait! Oh, Moigami's... She's able to convince both of them? That's right. Convince Shido. Win him over through a date. Oh god, I feel like some ridiculous fan service is about to happen. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Humility? No! Just make his heart go Doki Doki! Dates. Oh. <laughs> and the one who steals Itsuka's lips. Yo, they're gonna actually just cut it off at this point. Tenka would probably take that so literally. Wow. It's crazy. Watching Tenka in just like a regular, you know, casual outfit like this. It says this is the first time we've ever like interacted with an inverted spirit so casually. Right? Eat my damn strawberry. <laughs> I don't know. Who the, who the hell is she? Just some employee, I think. Looks cute. Hey, be nice. Something degenerate's coming. <laughs> cute! Ah! <laughs> Yo, we haven't seen this one since like Bochi, I remember. Okay, it's a maid cafe after all. Tenka, you have to do it too. Look at the face! Tenka, do something. Give me a moi moi kyun. Moi moi ki- Oh! <laughs> that was way too regal. You're doing this too seriously. No, you can't just force him to eat it like that. Oh my- Oh my god. Oh. You know, if this is Kyohei, he would die for this kind of treatment, huh? Kyohei would love to be, you know, be sat on like the- Oh. I think you broke Shido's neck there, but I think his neck is actually broken there. Kamile, to be healing it. Can't even understand you. What are you saying? This is hilarious, though. What an interesting date. It's like double date, but it's not just any regular date. Not the fact that it's a Muku, but like Tenka. Like an inverted spirit. We're casually on a date with an inverted spirit. Somehow when I think about inverted spirits, I remember like world destruction, just evil. Everything will be is doomed. But now it's like, all right, we're at a meat cafe. And she's fucking saying, eat the fucking cake, you pig. And sips on him. I love Tenka. She is great. She hasn't officially said her name yet. But again, you guys have been saying Tenka Tenka in the comment section. But it's totally Tenka, right? Who's going to win Shido's lips? Tenka at this rate might actually just cut Shido's lips. Literally, but I think she might get to kiss him before Muku, but it's Muku's date. This is supposed to be Muku's org. Where the fuck did Tenka show up from? Where the fuck did Moigami show up from? Regardless, I'm loving how this is going, but hey, if you're still here, if you do enjoy this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for even more content, and until next time, take care.